Aftershocks continue to be detected in Pohang. Three relatively weak tremors struck the city this morning. With the area now designated a special disaster zone, funds will be freed up to provide relief to local residents and to help rebuild. Oh jung -hee looks into what the government will be doing to help. Three relatively weak aftershocks struck the earthquake-hit city of Pohang on Tuesday morning. The first was a magnitude 2.0 tremor at around 6 o'clock, followed by a magnitude 2.1 quake just before 9. And a third aftershock of magnitude 2.4 hit the city just before 10. These were the first aftershocks in 24 hours after strong tremors of magnitude 3.5 and 3.6 hit the area late Sunday night and early Monday. The total number of aftershocks since last Wednesday's earthquake stands at over 60. Promising all-out efforts to contain and prevent further damage from the series of tremors, the government designated Pohang as a special disaster zone on Monday. The move is aimed at lessening the regional government's administrative and financial burden during the recovery process. Roughly 65 percent of the budget required for restoration projects in Pohang will be covered by the government. For local taxpayers who've been affected by the quake, the country's tax service is providing deadline extensions and halting tax investigations. Tax will also be deducted for businesses that have seen over 20 percent of their property damaged. Fees for health insurance, gas and electricity will be reduced, and some citizens could start their military service a little later or be exempt from mobilization training. Oh Jung-hee, Arirang News.